Alright guys, I know it's been a while since I've been posting, but basically I've been dealing with school, so I haven't been posting for the past couple of weeks. So um, hope so. Hopefully we'll be going back to normal. If you uh, want to see more videos, make sure you hit the notification bell. And I got some exciting news. I am now. I'm gonna be posting since uh, it's gonna be Columbus Day weekend. Um, I'm gonna be posting three videos on. on on three days, which is Columbus Day weekend. So hopefully that will make up for the past uh, several videos I've missed. So I hope you enjoy this video and hopefully this will make you a lot happier. See you. What's up guys, this is Aiden. So today we are making donkatsu. Now donkatsu is Japanese fried pork cutlet. Be now this dish is very um has a special place in my heart because it's one of like the f the very first dishes I have ever tasted in my life and I want to show you how I make it at home. So I got uh, some pork cutlets over here or pork loin, however you want to pronounce it. And I'm just going to take this meat hammer and just tenderize the meat. Yeah, guys, and you want to do this on both sides. All right, uh, second uh, side, guys, and and just flatten that side, this side as well too. All now, guys, once your meat is nice and tender, um, take your meat, uh, put it into some uh, frying mix or flour now the, the frying mix i have is made specially for donkatsu now put it drip it into the egg and now put it into punk into some panko breadcrumbs I'm gonna do this four more times. Now guys, this is not a very like convenient food. Well, it is sort of like a convenient food, but it's m very messy. So I recommend to clean your kitchen before you um, make this dish because honestly, if you already have a messy kitchen, um, it is, there's just gonna be more work for you after you make this dish. So. Bear in, bear in mind. Alright, this is going to be the second to last one. Alright, last cutlet into the frying mix. Into the egg. Into the breadcrumbs. There you go. Uh, your uh, pork cutlets are all uh, done. Now all like have like the panko breadcrumbs on it. So I'll take you to the next step. All right, guys. Um, I got some hot oil over here, and we're just gonna take our uh, cutlets and just put it in, into the hot oil. Okay, and uh, these cutlets are going to be in here for around uh, 6 minutes and flip them over at the 3 minute mark. Well guys, this is what it looks like when it's all done. Um, I made it into a sandwich. Hopefully, uh, it, so uh, it, it's meant to taste really good, so um, hopefully I'll see you again soon. And, and until next time, bye bye.